Should the New York Knicks trade for Damian Lillard? Stephen A. Smith thinks so. You're watching New York Knicks Now by Chat Sports. I'm your host, Marshall Green. In today's show, we're going to go over what Stephen A. Smith said about the New York Knicks, or at least why he wants to trade for Damian Lillard, and we'll talk about if that's a good idea in just a second. But first, make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. You're watching Knicks Now by Chat Sports. I'm your host, Marshall Green. We put out videos every single day on the latest Knicks news and rumors every day. So hit that sub button. You love the Knicks. You want content every day. Go down right now. Hit that big red sub button. So after the Knicks lost game six to the Miami Heat, Stephen A. Smith put out a little Twitter video and we transcribed that. And we got the quote for you coming up in a second. But the tweet said, pain. I want Dane. Oh, Stephen, Stephen, Stephen. Well, this was the full quote. He said, needed a few minutes. The season's over. I guess in the end, I always knew the New York Knicks would lose. Tom Thibodeau, team can't shoot, but you only play Evan Fournier 27 games this season. Don't give him a second of time in the playoffs. Grimes air ball at the end of the game. Jalen Brunson, spectacular, 41 points, but he's the only one who showed up. R.J. Barrett, 1 of 10, shooting from the field. Really? Really? And you've got the nerve to be sensitive about criticism? Julius Randle. Julius Randle. Julius Randle. Three for 14. Once again, the playoffs arrive. Once again, you fold. Done. I'm done. It's time to trade Julius Randle. It's time for him to go. Stephen A. Smith was very upset about the way the New York Knicks lost in that playoff game, and he finished off that quote by saying, I want Damian Lillard. Don't care what you got to do. I want Damian Lillard. Stephen A. Smith. Damian Lillard? Really? You want to trade for D Damian Lillard? Really? Come on, Stephen. We already have a point guard. We have Jalen Brunson. Oh, wow, Stephen A. We'll break it down. Should they do it, though? Should the Knicks trade for Damian Lillard? Let me know what you think. Type D for trade. Type P for pass. I'll share what I think about this subject coming up in a second. But first, I got to give you a huge shout out to our proud sponsor of today's show, Bird Dogs. Go to birddogs.com and use the promo code chat, and they're going to hook you guys up with a Yeti style tumbler for free when you go to birddogs.com and use the promo code chat. You know what they say dress for the job you want, not the job you have. But what if you're not sure what the day will bring? That's where Bird Dogs comes in. As a viewer of Knicks Now, you know I value versatility in all aspects of life. And Bird Dogs shorts and pants are the perfect example of that. With summer weather upon us, I've been wearing my bird dogs on the golf course to meeting, on dates, and just hanging out with the, with the homies. With bird dogs, you'll never have to worry about changing your outfit midday again. Plus, their stretchy fabric makes them more comfortable than any other shorts or pants out there. Ready to try them out for yourself? Click the link in the description below. Go to birddogs.com and enter the promo code chat to get a free Yeti-style tumbler with your purchase. That is bird dogs. Dot com. Remember, promo code chat. Support the show. Support the sponsor. We would greatly, greatly appreciate it. And get yourself some swaggy shorts. I'm really particular about the way my shorts fit. And Bird Dogs, they have mastered it. So get yours. They got pants. They got shorts. You can pick the length of the short. They got all different types of colors and styles. Let's get swagged up for the summer. Let's ride. Bird Dogs. BirdDogs.com. Promo code chat. Trading for Damian Lillard makes absolutely zero sense for the New York Knicks. Why would the New York Knicks trade for a point guard when they have Jalen Brunson and one like Damian Lillard that costs a whole bunch of money and someone that doesn't even really want to leave Portland? The Knicks finally have a point guard. They finally have Jalen Brunson. And now you want Damian Lillard? What, you want to play a backcourt of Damian Lillard and Jalen Brunson? You want to have the smallest backcourt in the NBA? You want to have the worst defensive backcourt in the NBA? I just, I just don't get it. Why would you want to have Jalen Brunson and Damian Lillard on the same team? Someone make it make sense. Because this contract, I ain't paying that. $45.5 million this season. $48.7 million next season. Then it jumps up to $58.5 million. Then in 2026, when he is 36 years old, you're going to pay him $63 million? Really, Steven? Really? This pisses me off. This is an absolute joke. 
Stephen A. Smith, you are great at your job. You're one of the best in the world. That's why you have the platform that you have. And I know you're a fan. And I know you've said you're an irrational New York Knicks fan. This is one of the dumbest things I have ever heard. Why would the New York Knicks, with Jalen Brunson, who just put together one of the best seasons a Knicks point guard has had since Walt Clyde Frazier, why would you want to take the ball out of his hands when he's much younger and much cheaper than Damian Lillard? Look what Jalen Brunson did this season. And just say thank you. Appreciate what you have. You finally have a guy at the point guard spot who is a top five, top six, top seven player at his position. In the regular season, he gave you 24.6 assists, 50% from the deck, and 42% from downtown. In the playoffs, he got better. He elevated his game. He went from 24 points to 27.8 points per game. He also gave you six dimes, five rebounds, and shot 47% from the floor. He gave you 38 points in a closeout game at home. He gave you 42 points in a closeout game on the road where nobody showed up, and you want to take the ball out of this guy's hands? Steven, this is why people hate on the New York Knicks. This is why the New York Knicks are the floor mat and the doormat of all NBA fans in the eyes of everybody else. Why on earth would you trade for Damian Lillard? What are you going to trade, Julius Randle? And now you just have the you're you're the, the you're the New York Littles out there. You have two six foot guards in the backcourt. I understand the shot creation. I understand the playmaking, but you got to win. And you got to win with defense. That's what happens when you win in New York. You do it with defense, not with a guy like Damian Lillard who can't even carry his team to the playoffs consistently. The Knicks have been in point guard hell for a while, and they got out of it with Jalen Brunson. And now you don't even want to give them the proper respect? We went from Chris Duhon to Raymond Felton to Tony Douglas to Raymond Felton to Pablo Prigioni to Shane Larkin to Jose Calderon to Derrick Rose to Ramon Sessions. Then we went to Trey Burke, Alonzo Trier, Alfred Payton, Kemba Walker. Then we went to Jalen Brunson. And now you want to trade for Dame Lillard? Stephen A., you are a clown for this take, my man. Get a grip. There are so many better players out there that would compliment Jalen Brunson, that would compliment the New York Knicks and make the New York Knicks a better basketball team. And I don't want to disrespect Dame because Dame is great, but the fit makes no sense. And he is slowly, I would say, declining. Even though he averaged the most points per game this year in his career, he only played in 58 games. And before that, he played in 29 games. And he wasn't good in 2021. He shot 40% from the field and 32% from downtown. Was he dealing with injuries? No doubt about it. Dame is great. Dame time is one of my favorite times in the world. He is an electric player. He is a clutch player. No doubt about it. But the man is going to be 33 years old in July. And you want to trade for him and pair him next to Jalen Brunson in the backcourt? I don't know. And I'll say this. Jalen Brunson is better than Damian Lillard. I said it. He is. He's more of a winner. He does things to control the game more. And he's just better. But I'll ask you. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe you think Dame is better. Pick a point guard. Who would you rather have as your point guard? Is it Jalen Brunson? Is it Damian Lillard? Type JB for Jalen Brunson. Type DL for Damian Lillard. If it ain't JB, I don't want it. I don't want Damian Lillard. Not at all. Let me know what you think down in the comment section. As always, thank you. And I appreciate everybody for tuning in to Knicks Now by Chat Sports. We're going to continue to put out videos, fun videos, and content like this. Every day, all summer long, we'll be live for the NBA draft, even though the Knicks don't have a pick. We'll be live for NBA free agency. We're your one-stop shop all off-season long. Hit that sub button and hit that thumbs-up icon. Enjoy your weekend.